Hello, fellow possibilitarians. Lynn Hare here. I am your chief possibilitarian, exploding Matthew 19:26 possibilities wide open. I just thought I would share a quick tip for you today. And this tip is about how to activate your possibilities, how to activate your breakthrough. I go for uh, prayer walks most days in my neighborhood. Right now, I'm sitting on a playground of a Parks and Rec Center close to my house in Southeast Portland. And as I do this, um, I'm really close to a middle school track uh, where I used to teach. And what I'm thinking about right now is about when we want to activate possibilities, we can lean into listening. You know, scripture says, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. And as we listen to the word of God, things get activated. You know, the resonant frequency of heaven, what God is pulling down from heaven, gets to be deposited here on the earth when we listen to his word. On my way over here, I was listening to Galatians. And the scripture that the Holy Spirit shared was, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. You know, we're listening, we're listening, we're listening, and God's speaking to us all the time. Do you know that he speaks over your spirit? Do you know he speaks over your mind? Do you know he speaks over your emotions and your body all the time? Well, this is really cool. As you're listening to scripture, God's activating that living, breathing pulse within you. And um, when I listen to scripture, it wakes something up in me. When I listen to scripture, I kind of start getting connected with God thoughts instead of mine. This is really cool because sometimes I reach the end of me and I'm like, I don't know what my next thought is. What do I do this week? Like what's happening on my schedule? But then I'm listening to the active word of God and I'm hearing him express what he's about to do. And he's a lot brighter and a lot more filled with wisdom than I am. There's a true connectedness that takes place. Uh, I also listen to worship. I make up playlists that are in my YouTube uh, on my YouTube account, and um, I put together ones that are similar. Like one I have that's a list of intimacy. It has really cool, soft songs about the Lord. Um, and then I have another one called Possibilitarian. And then there's a that Possibilitarian playlist has um, a bunch of cool things that are activating my hope. There's percussion. There's greatness. There's connectedness in that upbeat, uh, the upbeat percussion. And then another thing that I have done uh, on the YouTube channel, I put on certain songs that I just lift my spirit up. That's praise and it's thanksgiving. I love listening to that worship because it activates in me gratitude and thankfulness. And did you know that when you think and speak out and write about gratitude, that it can shift a chaotic heart rhythm into one that's smooth and rhythmic like ocean waves. And so this is really cool because as, we're, as you're doing that and as you're activating this sense of peace and gratitude, God is sh literally shifting the atmosphere but he's also making a shift in you. So as I go on these prayer walks every day, I feel so connected with heaven and that scripture, the resonant frequency of heaven is waking up in me and that, that scripture, the truth is pointing me back to true north and where I'm sitting true north is over that way. Doink, doink, doink. <laughs> so um, I am praying for you that as you're going for a walk and as you're getting connected with the sounds of heaven, that you're kind of doing the same thing I am when I'm walking. And it goes scripture, worship, scripture, worship, like that. And um, some worship is scripture set to music. Um, here's an example is I didn't even know that um, when I was singing How Great Is Our God and part of the phrase for that song is and time is in his hands. I didn't know that that was a scripture verse. Go figure. So anyway, um, I feel connected with God when I'm listening to that. So I'm going for a walk. Sometimes I go for a couple of prayer walks. It gives me fresh air. It oxygenates my body, oxygenates my mind. But more importantly, it wakes up my spirit so that my spirit is on top. And if you want to be connected with God as a possibilitarian, activating possibilities with hope-filled expectation, that expectation can come when you're listening to his voice and you're listening to his pulse and you're listening for his music and his sound throughout your day. So that was my quick tip, possibilitarians. I would encourage you to answer in the, uh, down below in the comments, what do you do to activate faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God? Lord's blessings to you guys. Take care.